Hey guys, it's Kyle Mappagan Wild Racing and uh, back for another night of racing. It is Friday night, Friday night special here at The Rock. Uh, Race starts at uh, 7.30 um, and uh, we, we get about two hours of practice. Practice starts at 5.30. Um, I just got here. Uh, Dad is literally about to go out to practice. I don't have time to put a car and put the camera on, uh, but we'll, have, we'll get some footage of uh you know just just the practice session but uh about to go out um hopefully have a good night tonight hopefully have some fun and uh you know enjoy a good friday night uh, uh at the racetrack so uh, follow along for the night and hope you guys enjoy it but we're going out to practice right now so gotta get uh gotta get up to the wall done with uh, the first practice. I made it here just in time. Uh, apparently we're having a clutch issue, uh, so we're going to have to get that fixed. And it's a quick turnaround between practice and qualifying. We'll see if we can get it done. Uh, I didn't know uh, uh, Chad Knaus is going to be here. What? I didn't know Chad Knaus was going to be here. I just got here. I don't think you get the joke. What? Seems to be the problem, Dad. Clutch. Clutch ain't right. Clutch ain't right. Here, here. Okay. Here, here. Yeah. Jake, grab the hood. In a hurry. Come on. You gotta go over a race. We're sending the cars out. Should be able to make. Should be able to make uh, qualifying here. There's a couple cars not out there either. Dad's getting suited up. I think we got the clutch right. We'll find out though. We're gonna have to uh, see what happened to the car. We didn't get uh, much time to do anything besides work on the clutch, uh, but still qualified fourth, so that's pretty good. Um, we'll get Dad's thoughts on first practice and uh, qualifying. <laughs> All 
Alright, yeah, how was uh, first practice? Uh, clutch was slipping real bad. The car felt good, but the clutch was slipping real bad. He come in and uh, re shim the throw out there. Um, anyways, qualifying it was pushing like crazy because we were working on the clutch. We didn't have time to set my tires. It pushed like crazy. We qualified fourth, so couldn't be that bad. Well, I could. But uh, starting on the outside, that's not good. Am I? Well, well I, yeah, I guess. It, do we know the draw? For the feature? Uh, six. six? Yeah, he's probably uh, still going to be on the outside. So. No, Greg. Greg started on the pole. I think. I don't know. Just to get the car. Oh, right. Go up there and see um, Go up there and see what the lineup is for. All right. Okay. All right. Take a walk up there. All right. Let's see where we're starting for the A main. Starting fourth. Uh, behind the thirds rather behind the uh, 33 which is 33 is getting pretty lucky Greg another pole starting position third for the heat race third for the heat race yep yeah, right there so we'll see what we can do about to put out heat races they're doing the Canadian national anthem right now so close to Canada we always do that um, but we're about to start with the uh, late model heats so Time to start racing. Those were your fast qualifiers for the late models. That's the heat race number one. Uh, quick turnaround for us. I'm not going to be able to get any uh, of that heat race. Uh, but we're getting ready to get out for our heat. And uh, see where we roll, see where we end up. Hopefully get some points. Got an old friend stopping by with Dad. Jimmy Gullet? Yeah, the old Mount Clemens guy. Yeah, old Mount yeah. Clemens guys. <laughs> right. You're the sign. Huh? I wish we were still at Mount Clemens. Yeah, I, think, I think a lot of people wish Mount Clemens was still around, but but we keep the Mount Clemens guys alive here. There you go. Yeah. yeah. Any game plan? Nope. Just finish? Just Don't finish. crash. Ride the race. I was just waving to my granddaughter. Oh. <laughs>
not every day I beat you. Yeah, the clutch isn't slipping and it works on top. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, how'd it, how'd it feel, Dad? Look, excellent. Race really winner, you look tired. Any, any time you can beat the man on the outside, that's a good freaking thing. Yeah, you, no, you did a good job, Doug. The crowd was. But I could see he was he was really good, so he, he's not. He'll make some adjustments and he'll be better, so. That's why. I got. I got lucky because you know, too often you beat Greg. Yeah, well, you put a good show. Everyone in the stands are going crazy. That was pretty cool. Yeah, that was a good show. Yeah, that was good. Good job. All right, so good finish in the heat race. Super, super happy about that. Uh, about to go out for the feature here in a, in a couple minutes. Obviously, we still got to run the uh, late mile feature, but we are going to put a camera on the five car Eric Lee. Uh, for the feature, and uh, he's, he was fast qualifier, he's starting 12th, uh, we'll see what he can do, uh, and uh, see if he can work his way up to the front and put on a show for us, uh, we we'll, we'll, should have a pretty cool camera angle for this, so let's ride around with uh, Eric Lee. Good race, fun race. 
Wish uh, it was a little better for Eric. Uh, but it's our turn now. Uh, starting third. We'll see what happens in this uh, feature. Maybe we can uh, do what we did in the uh, heat. We pray for safety. And we pray that we glorify you. We pray to Son Jesus Christ's only precious name. Amen.
job. Hey, it was fun being with the man. I know, it was awesome. That was Watch good. Oh, there's the winner. There he is. Hey, wait a minute. Whoa, we got one, two, three right here. One, two, three. Hey. That's what good queen racing looks like out there. Oh, man. How was it, Dad? Good. You were fast. Just not that last restart couldn't get it done. Yeah. He did what he was supposed to. He took me up high. Yeah, he did. Then it took me out of my groove a little bit. It didn't stick as good as it did in the heat race. He made adjustments to his car and he was faster, so. I, you were faster than him though. Oh, yeah. yeah, I mean, you were good. Just yeah. unfortunately not outside faster. Right. Uh, right. But yeah, you guys. It was good, I was happy. Yeah. Home and He's a good driver. All right, hey guys, it's time for our pit stop. Today we're gonna be talking with Eric Lee. Um, Eric Lee's been racing for about 20 years. Uh, he's known our family forever. Him and his, uh, or my dad and his dad, I believe they raced together. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, I think they raced together back in Mount Clemens. Mount Clemens, yeah. yeah. And um, he's got four championships in the super late models here at Flat Rock. And uh, I grew up watching him. I always thought it was really cool uh, to know one of the best drivers at the track. So that was always really cool to see. But he agreed to uh, talk with us for a little bit. So. Uh, I guess we can start with the, our first question. You know, how'd you get into racing? Uh, by watching my dad. So I used to uh, go to the track every Thursday, Friday, Saturday night, starting at Mount Clemens Speedway, watching uh, my dad, and then um, helping him on the car. He raced here for a few years, helped him here, and then uh, probably when I was about 14, 13, I started racing go-karts. So I uh, traveled around uh, Michigan, Indiana, Ohio, went down to uh, North Carolina, um, did some go-kart racing, and then um, about 16 years old, I got uh, got into uh, race cars. Did you, did you run the go-kart series at my dad? Uh, we ran uh, WKA. Yeah, okay. yeah, WK Road Karting Association. Okay. Um, yeah. Mostly up like East Lansing, and then um, kind of tra traveled around quite a bit. Right. So. so what, uh, you've been racing obviously quite a while, what has been like either your biggest achievement or maybe something you've learned and uh, maybe both those things um probably i mean winning a championship definitely is tough but it's uh especially now the competition so stiff it's really really hard to uh win races and, and win championships um but it's just that you know what i, what I learned is that really the hard work pays off you got to do your homework um you got to uh spend your time in the shop you got to uh, improve every week and make yourself better been having uh, you've had an amazing career racing career do you have any future plans um you know anything along those lines i know not, not really my, might be uh, past getting my, into nascar my, but. yeah my uh, my my career is winding down so we're just having fun um we did a lot of travel in the last probably three or four years and uh we kind of said we're just going to race closer to home these last few years so uh, we're still having fun we're still doing good so uh, we'll continue doing it until we, uh, until we can and we're still having fun so probably uh you're not gonna see me on uh, sunday race soon or anything, right. or anything yeah. but uh, we're just having fun and uh like it's good it's good uh good experience with our friends and my dad and, and everyone that helps out so. cool i appreciate you uh, giving me the minute appreciate you uh, riding along with us and you know you had an eventful race there but hey, yeah it, it is was, what it is and you'll come back next time stronger yeah, yeah we got a good piece so we'll be back so. yeah awesome well thanks right, again thank you. so that was really cool for me again that was a guy that i looked up to growing up um just cool to you know ride along with him tonight um, you know wish he could have got a win for us but hey uh, one of those racing deals it looked like to me but yeah anyways i did i that was cool huh? Yeah, he does. Jeff knows how to make them old cars work good. Yeah. You guys really spanked them Jeff, last week. Jeff has never bought anything new in his life. <laughs> except his house. Yeah. Yeah, I want to see what for it, but it stick like it did in the heat race. <laughs> <laughs> Probably because the other car stuck a little bit better. Yeah. Well, all in all, I say it was a pretty good night. Um, you know, finishing third there in the feature. Uh, you know, obviously would have liked to have a better restart, but, you know, Greg did what he had to do there and, uh, you know, had a great restart and uh, unfortunately the outside didn't stick as well and as it did earlier in the night, but hey, that's just the way it goes, but a good finish, car drove onto the trailer, a huh. huge shout out to uh, 
Clarity uh, for finishing second. I believe that's her best finish in the feature, which is which is great, or maybe tied for best finish. I'm not sure, but uh, great job to her. Uh, you know, filling that hole and it opened up. So uh, good restart, and she did her job. So congrats to her, and uh, again to Greg. Uh, even though we want to catch him in the points, uh, hey, he uh, he's he's having a really good start to his season. So uh, congrats to him. You know, good friends of ours. So. Uh, you know hopefully we can catch him though uh but anyways good night drove the car on the trailer now i'm ready to go home it's late and but tomorrow's saturday and i get to sleep in which is gonna be pretty sweet so that's exciting anyways uh thanks for watching click like subscribe and uh we'll see you in the next one